What is going on guys, Voltron Plays here, and today I'm bringing you guys another video on Dragon Ball Z Doga Metal. Today we are going to be discussing the World Tournament, not playing it yet, <laughs> but my next video will be me playing it every day. I'll play a little bit of it, but in case you guys are wondering if I haven't been playing it all day and you're like freaking out in your head, you're like, why are you playing it? You're dumb. If it loads, doesn't like to load, and I already told you about that update problem. I think they actually fixed that for the most part though, because it's been loading pretty good. So, yeah, <laughs> I don't know why it's shipping right now. I haven't restarted the app after I close it out yet, so usually when I don't do that, it kind of kind of freaks out a little bit inside its head. I'm going to give it three seconds time to restart it. All right, I'm restarting it. All right, take two. We're back. Uh, now, if I click on it, it, it loads. Ha, ha, you see, 17,000. Whoa. Wow. You see, it actually drops if you don't play. So that was at, like, 16,000 something just a few minutes ago. So if you don't play, there's going to be people that are constantly... Passing you up on rank. So yeah, I haven't played in a little bit. It's been like 10, maybe 15 minutes actually. And already, I'm a thousand ranks below. So if you do end up getting in that top 100 slots, you might drop out of there really quick if you're not consistently playing. So uh, yeah, I, I bet people are just literally playing this game constantly for the next five or four days or however long this is out. Which we'll see in a second. So anyways, I just want to show you guys that I have indeed been playing. Not as much as I wanted to. But I've still been playing. So I have five five wins on there. It's decent. I want to get in the top like five thousand around there, so I could really so I could get that SSR, which you're about to find out about right now if you don't know about. <laughs> so there's a lot of things that have been added with this update, or where they added all the world tournament and all that. So um, and where do I start? What's right here? So world tournament opens. The world tournament opens. Do you have what it takes? It's time for you to enter the fray. The first world tournament opens today at 3 o'clock. Well, actually, 3 o'clock military time. Uh, do you battle with strong opponents standing in your way and rank up the wins? Why can't lead to wins? Are you seeing luxurious rewards? Uh, so you can mysterious ritual Elder Kai. Selecting him as a training partner will guarantee super attack level up by 1. SSD, SSD, SSR guaranteed tickets. A chance to summon extremely powerful characters to join our team. I'll show you guys that in a second. So you can get these by uh, high ranking rewards or complete the tournament related special missions. Uh, DB Saga summon tickets. Great chance to summon many world, many tournament exclusive characters. Uh, you could get them by competing girl, uh, completing the tournament related special missions, missions, or uh, ranking rewards. New awakening medals. So these you could use to awaken uh, Master Roshi. Which ah, you get this one up here, this one right there. You get them by uh, just doing the mission. I think you have to know you have to hit uh, Master Roshi tier. I'll show you guys the tier tiers in a second. So you have to hit Master Roshi tiers, and then you get him, and then you get the. I have the first three. It's like there's just three normal ones. It's like Bubbles, Gregory, and uh, I think Doctor Jero, something like that. It's just like three bronze ones, and then you have the Bulmas and the the little turtle dude. Uh, I already got the turtles done, and I need six more Bulmas. So yeah, I got them if you're just like playing around the map once you're like the final tier, and I think the quarterfinals too. Like not tier, the uh, part of the mission, because like there's preliminaries, and there's uh... I don't know. There's four little stages, right? Preliminaries, one, and then quarterfinals and finals. So in the quarterfinals and finals, you can find those little gold ultra rares, uh, awakening medal, and if you go and pick them up around the map, you'll, uh, you'll get chances of these guys, it's either Bulma or Turtle, I think, all the time. So, other common medals are still needed to perform the Dogen Awakening above. Uh, to say, say very, oh, I, I guess they use them on uh, Chi Chi, too. I could probably do that. I literally haven't checked Chi Chi at all. I totally forgot about that. So there you go, you could get her, too. I think I have that. One of those Chi Chi, I might have those. Uh, other common medals are needed to perform the Dogen Awakening above. That's the Dogen Awakening over there. Wait, wait, the status of the same Dogen Awakening character vary on what... Okay. In addition to the same rewards above, more splendid rewards. There's basic rules. Okay. And then, yeah, I've already read you guys this in my last video. But you could earn those... Oh, yeah, they added those statues that give you money now when you sell them. You get a lot of Dragon Stones and a lot of Saga uh, tickets. You get a lot of training places. Um, there you go. All right, so into the first... Here's all the missions uh, to do stuff with. So... You, there's a lot to read through. Reach Beerus tier, five dragon stones. Reach Elder Kai tier, uh, and Elder Kai. Um, reach Supreme Kai tier, five dragon stones. Reach King Kai tier, five training places at uh, Supreme Kai planet. Uh, King Yama tier is ten uh, snake ways. Kami tier is a dragon stone. Korin tier is ten uh, sensu beans. Sensu bean. Master Roshi tier is 
30 uh, Gregory medals. The Delta here is a training place for what's uh, what's it's uh, King Cos planet. Then you get the statue, Dragonstone. Uh, 100 wins in the first world tournament is the is the um, SSR guaranteed ticket. 70 wins in the first tournament is uh, seven Dragonstones. 50 wins in the first tournament is five Dragonstones. There's a lot. So 30 wins. Spring Kai. I don't know what that times 10 is right there. Training place probably. I've never seen that one. So the Sensi Beans. Uh, probably another training place. There's a lot. A lot of DB Saga tickets you could get. Uh, so here's the event tournaments for everything that they've added with this. For the first world tournament, it is here until Tuesday. The SSR guaranteed summons here until Monday, along with the DB Saga and the special missions. Um, yeah, so there's all that. Just showing you guys what you need to get to access it all. And then if we go and look at the summons that they've added with this, there's my great Sam Man 2. She's awesome. Finally got her to do a UR, so that's great. Alright, and I also finally got to rank 50. I've been grinding out on this game a lot, because I want to get to level 100 eventually. <laughs> It'll take a while, but I'll eventually get there. Alright, so uh, here's the guaranteed SSR. Let's go to the character list, and I'll show you the scouter. The scouter doesn't show them all. So we have the Kaioken Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, uh, time 2, Super Saiyan Vegeta, times 2. Modern Vegeta, Super Trunks, Super Saiyan Trunks, Super Saiyan Gohan, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, Frieza Final Form, Piccolo, Trunks, Xenoverse, Boo, Super, Cooler Final Form, Super Saiyan Gohan Adult, Majin Boo, Good, Majin Boo, Pure Evil, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Whis, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, another one, Perfect Cell, Super Saiyan Bardock, and Golden Frieza. If we go to the Scouter, it uh, shows a little bit different of peeps. Load. Load. Okay. So here's all the characters I was just listing off. I just want to show you guys them in case you were wondering which ones they were. So I don't, I don't think it shows them all. But there you go. It's a World Tournament Prize with DB Saga Summon Tickets. Um, so uh, all these characters have a key. They have a, uh, a link skill that they all go together. It's right there. They key plus 2 and attack plus 20%. So there's two S, three SSRs they added with this one, and these tickets are easy to get for the bronze ones. I don't know about the gold ones. I don't know how to get those ones. I think it's probably the same way as the other gold ones, as the other thing. But you have this kid Goku right here, attack plus seven. Yeah, he's he's pretty good. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie, he's really good actually. And then there's this King Pick Alo, which is he's really good too. And there's Elder King Piccolo. They're both really good. Yeah. This just wants more defense. And then there's uh, this Bulma, which is SR. These guys are all SRs. Yapsha, Tien, Oolong, uh, General Blue. I didn't. I thought. I thought they'd all be showed. Yeah, all the three SSRs and just the SRs. And there's a bunch of like uh, four rares, which I've gotten. <laughs> I've gotten the rares. I haven't got any SRs or SSRs yet. The Ninja Gamer got the King Piccolo right there, though. Lucky maggot. Um. So yeah, how it all works if we go over here into the tournament. Excuse that accent. <laughs> uh, Alright, so if you go to rewards, it'll show you all what they could get. It, it didn't include all the rewards. So, there's a lot of rewards you could get. For 100 to 100th place, you could get two Super, Super Saiyan 2 Gohans, um, the Tech Type SSR. You could get five of the Elder Kai SSRs. One million Zenny Hercule Statue Gold times three, which means you get three million Zenny. Uh, the gold SSR guaranteed ticket times one and then 137 awakening medals 101 through a thousandth place is one Super Saiyan 2 Gohan three elders Kai statues three million Zenis the three statues uh, SSR guaranteed ticket and then the awakening medal which is under 37 so then uh, mysterious you get for a hundred <laughs> a thousand and one to two thousand five hundredth place you get three elder Kai's three million Zenny one SR, SSR guarantee ticket, one DB Saga summon ticket, um, for what, uh, for what, uh, what is it called, what is it called, the gold one, okay, <laughs> 137 awakening medals, uh, and this one's the same, except you get two Elder Kai's instead of one, this one you get two, but you get three Hercule Statues, and then awakening medals, what is, wait, what is the difference between these two, I don't, I don't see a difference, these two, okay. 
Same for 5,000, 1 to uh, 10,000 places. Like maybe it's just different metals. I don't know. Um, okay. And this, there is this one already? Yep. So 135 to the 137 metals. Basically, they just start earning less stuff. So basically, in order to get the little guaranteed SSR ticket, I think you have to be into this place right here, which I'm already in this. It's really easy to get into. I've only played it five times. So, yeah, rank of three or two digits, you get one of him. The rank of four or two digits, you get another Kai. Five, you get an SSR guaranteed ticket. Times three. Silvers. Silvered ones. You need five to do a assuming. Oh, wait, these ones you're just getting uh, the silver SSR ones. In order to get the gold one, you need to be up here. So, yeah, you kind of want to get up here. <laughs> so, I want to get, you basically just want to get above 5,000. But in order to get the Gohan, you want to be in the 1,000s. So, you really got to grind out for these ones. I forgot to click on what I still got of that. So, yeah, in order to get the good rewards, you basically got to be high up there. Um, and then you can go to the rankings tab to see where you rank, where your friends rank, uh, and there's the top people in the ranks. I think earlier living Ichigo was actually really high up here. Let's see where he is. See on here? Yeah, I think that's him, right? Right there? So, yeah, people do grind out on this a lot. This guy up here has been grinding out. I click on the wrong thing. This guy up here, you can grind the heck out of it. So, <laughs> I think these are the top 100 people. Wait, this person has my. That's not Fidel. Silly person. It's good to say man, too. So, he doesn't even. See, you don't have to have UR. See, so up here? You are your leader. You probably have him somewhere else. So, there's a top 30, and then if you get a self. You see where you, or in this case where I rank, loads. It's like refreshing because there's constantly people playing. I don't think it actually shows me on here though. Right? Nope, there I am. So it shows who's around me and how many times you can click on what their tier is, how many times they won, how many points they have. So everybody around me is won. Oh, this guy's, why is, he, why is he so low if he won eight times? No idea. Then you could go and check where you and your friends are ranking at. Oh, which is pretty cool. So if you friend anybody, here you go. You can check who's above you. Which will done. Uh, the gamer is above me. Uh, and all these other friends are above me. This, these guys are in a thousand. Wow. I really got a sub in my game. Like a lot. Like a lot. Dang. So I'm just checking where people are right now on this. Because, uh, yeah, they're, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Yeah, they're pretty high up there. Pretty high up there. So, I gotta go back to rewards real quick, sorry. I know I'm kind of rambling on. I want to show you guys the tiers, too. Alright, so, uh... I'm not gonna read these all again, because I've read the most. Uh, let's see if it shows that go... What? Okay, yeah, I already read this all. I don't know why Gohan is not on there, though. But, you know, whatever. Whatever. It's fine. So then, if I'll get to tier... I'll show you guys the tiers. This, this whole thing's really cool. I'm really excited for this tournament. I'm finally glad I could read it all. Alright, so... About tiers. There's the B League, A League, S League, and then there's the G League. It's kind of weird when you like go to a different tier because you like jump. For example, you see how many are like like Hercule and T and uh, King Champa? It's because like when you play a little bit like on the Pilaf, if you like, if you like do really good, I didn't even go through King Champa, Hercule, or Videl the first time I played. I jumped right up to Master Roshi first game. I didn't like, I didn't go to Corin or Kami. I jumped right up to King Yema. So, it's, you don't always go tier by tier. So, yeah, I mean, that's hope if you thought you were going to have to go through every single one. You usually jump a few if you do good. Unless you like, really bad and lose. And you'll probably go into, like, the King Chapa, Hercule, or Videl. I don't know why so many people are in Videl. I didn't even get into that one. I think you still get the rewards for getting into them. I'm st Okay, earlier when I checked, nobody was in the Beerus. But now we got 31 people in the Beerus. <laughs> 665 in the Elder and 2,000-something in the Supreme Kai. And 4,000 something in the King Kai. So people are playing this a lot. Uh, I'm surprised people are even up there. It's kind of hard to get up in the tier. Let's see. Yeah. That's, for example, how much you need to get to the next tier. Uh, that's on King Yemma. And I already got a little bit. And I've played a little bit with this. I've actually only played one or two games with him, I think. So you do, if you play this game a lot, if you're willing to just devote some Dragon Stones and some time into it, You'll get high up there. So if you want the rewards, you're not counted out yet. You just got to keep playing. For example, go to sleep, wake up, play. Just play at least one game. Come back. You might drop a bit, but you'll still be up there. You won't drop completely unless you only play the first day and then don't play at all for the rest of the three days. You'll come back on and be like 25,000 rank. Be like, what happened? <laughs> but as you've seen from the, from the ranking, you only have to be like 
101,000 to even get something. So I think you'll no matter what get something if you play this game. But if you see the amount in the peel off tier, that's literally just probably people who haven't played the game yet. Have not the game, but haven't played the tournament yet. I bet that bar is going to shrink and all the other bars are going to grow, except for the Beerus tier, which is probably super hard to get into. Anyways, guys, <laughs> I've rambled on enough. So make sure you go and play the World Tournament. It's really cool and you get really awesome rewards for doing it. At least just one time you'll get super awesome rewards. All you gotta do is play it. That's really it. You just play it. It goes through preliminaries uh, and all that, which you'll see in my next video, which will be up soon after this one. Preliminary, quarterfinal, quarterfinal, semifinal, final. So yeah, you only gotta play four and that's one game. You can't change your team though while you're going through the game. So be careful, like when you set, when you start in the prelims, you're stuck with that team for the rest until you're done with the final. Then you can restart when you go back to prelims. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for liking this video, or not for liking, for watching this video. If you want to support the channel, please hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button down below. It lets me know you like my videos and supports my channel. Anyways, guys, I'm Voltron Plays, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.